guys welcome back to my channel today I'm going to be filming a one brand tutorial everything that I'm featuring today is going to be by benefit cosmetics I'm going to be starting off with a clean face and just moisturizing with my triple performance moisturizer with SPF 15 After I'm done moisturizing, I'm going to be taking my professional primer. I'm just going to be adding that to mostly my T-zone. And I'm going to be adding that just to mattify everything out and smooth everything out and create a really nice canvas for the foundation. Now after we prime the face, we're ready for foundation. I'm going to be taking my Hello Flawless Foundation in Petal and just adding that all over the face and rubbing it in with my fingers. After the foundation is applied, I'm going to be taking my Stay Don't Stray Concealer in light and just using it to conceal underneath the eyes and also highlight at the same time. I'm also going to be adding it to the bridge of my nose, on my chin and my forehead, and a little bit on my cupid's bow. Now just blend it out and what I really like about this product is that it's very versatile. You can also use it as an eyeshadow primer and also use it as concealer. So you can use it for a lot of things. Now going in with my favorite pressed powder, this is Hello Flawless Powder in Petal. It really gives you a really nice poreless look and I'm just going to be adding that all over the face. Now time to add some warmth, warmth, warmth to the skin. I'm going to be taking my Hoola bronzer and I'm just going to be adding that right around the whole hairline and also underneath my cheekbones to also contour at the same time. Underneath the um, jawline and also around the forehead. Now with the smaller fluffy brush, I'm just going to be taking the same Hoola bronzer and just be adding it to the sides of my nose to contour my nose. Now for one of my favorite blushes of all time, this is Sugar Bomb Blush by Benefit. I'm just going to be adding this to my cheeks and it just gives you like the most beautiful peachy sheen. It's just gorgeous for the summertime. Another one of my favorite products by Benefit is this What's Up highlighter. So cute, it's called What's Up. Like, Benefit has the cutest packaging and names. This is a cream highlighter, so I'm just gonna be taking my fingers and warm it up a little. I'm just gonna be adding it to the tops of my cheekbones, a little on top of my eyebrows, um, on the bridge of my nose, mostly on the tip of my nose, and then on my cupid's bow. Now that complexion is done, I'm gonna move on to my brows. I'm using the Browsing's Eyebrow Kit in Dark. Now taking an angled brush and just taking some of that beeswax on the left side of the kit, I'm just going to be lining out my brows. Going with the same brush, I'm just going to be taking the powder on the right and just filling it in. And now we're just going to repeat the same steps on the other eyebrow. Now taking my Stay Don't Stray Concealer again, adding it to the back of my hand and a concealer brush. I'm just going to be taking a little bit and just carving out my eyebrows and also bringing it down to the lid to prime my lids for eyeshadow. Now onto the eyeshadow, I'm going to be using my Big Beautiful Eyes eyeshadow palette and I'm going to be using the first, wait no, the middle I guess, 
eyeshadow and I'm just going to be adding that all over the lid with a flat shader brush. Now going in with the first eyeshadow, I'm just going to be adding that to the center of my lids just to add a little bit of dimension. And then going in with that dark brown eyeshadow, just adding that to the crease and blending it out. Now with the Bad Gal Liner in brown, I'm just going to be adding this to the bottom lash line. Don't worry about being too neat, we're just going to be smudging it out in just a little bit. Now something I really like about this liner, in the back of it, there's a smudger. I'm just going to be using that to smudge out the liner. Now taking that dark brown eyeshadow again from the palette, I'm just going to be adding it on top of the liner to just make it a little more smoky. Now taking that first eyeshadow again from the eyeshadow palette, I'm just going to be putting it on the eyebrow bone to highlight and also in the inner corners to highlight. And this is me being indecisive if I wanted brown or black eyeliner. So I went with the brown eyeliner. This is the Their Real Push Up Liner in brown. I'm just going to be lining my eyes and giving myself a wing. Now for a finishing touch for the eyebrows, I'm taking my Gimme Brow Eyebrow Gel in dark. I'm just going to be brushing that onto my eyebrow hairs. This is just going to keep them in place and also thicken them up to make them look a little fuller. Now this is my favorite mascara of all time and never smudges on me. This is the Their Real Mascara in black. I'm just going to be adding a nice coat on the top and bottom lashes. Now taking my highbrow pencil, I'm just going to be adding this to the waterline. This is going to help make the eyes appear larger and make them open up a little bit. And also add it to the eyebrow bone to highlight them even further. And now for some lashes, I'm going to be taking my favorite lashes by Benefit. These are my pinup lashes. I'm just going to be adding it to my eyes. Now just taking some mascara to help the lashes blend together and also taking a little bit of highbrow on the cupid's bow and the tip of my nose and blending it out. For the lips, I'm just going to be keeping it simple and using my Dallas lip gloss and just adding it all over the lips. Now the last step, I'm just going to be adding my Ultra Radiance Mist all over the face to rehydrate the face. And that is the finished look. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe, like, comment, and share this video. And I'll see you guys in my next video.